Hey y'all, so I'm gonna do a collection video again and these are on, bam, sorry. Y'all can't see that, Gucci sunglasses. I guess this would be better. Gucci sunglass collection. Um, I love Gucci in that they always stay true to being classic, but they spiff it up with different types of um, acetate and plastics and uh, enamels and crystals but they don't go too avant-garde or too far they just just on the border of being whoa it's out there and it's classic but most of their pieces you'll see through the season are always going to be classic they might have something like bamboo on them or G interlocking ggs and things like that or the gucci you know uh, coat of arms something like that so the first pair that i got that one of my favorite pairs are these they don't have names to them they are a gradient lens well none of none of them have names to them but these lenses are gradient and You'll see here that there's a GG encased in a type of the uh, plastic. And then you'll see the frame is like, look how pretty that is. It's, it is sparkly all the way around as far as the frame is concerned. You're probably not going to see that. Let me see if I can get it. They're sparkly and see-through. Almost reminds me of wood. I like it has a wood grain to it. This is what they look like on. Very classic, very big. Covers everything. This is what they look like from far side. Love them, love them, love them. They go with everything. They're so neutral that they go with everything and they just have enough G, you know, little, you know, eye candy right here as far as the GG logo and the frame. The plastic is concerned it's just absolutely gorgeous one of my favorite 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 glasses uh, sunglasses in all of my collections are these really really like them I love the actual color of the frame just makes it really unique tortoise color this is a true it is a tortoise tortoise is like a black and brown mixed together they have this really cute buckle here on the side when I first saw them I fell in love with them but I didn't want to pay full price for them so I waited a long time for these to go on sale these also have a, a gradient in them oh my goodness I got scratches on them. no I don't that's just dust I need to clean my glasses <laughs> so it gradiates very deeply I don't really like my eyes to show through the sunglasses I know I have a pair of Dior's that are a couple of pairs two one or two Dior's that I like that that I don't really care for but I like my eye but you know I don't like people seeing my actual eyelids but that's okay they're still fierce love them they're really cute and black too I like that they cover my eyebrows these are a heavier piece so they're heavy if you don't like sunglasses sitting on your cheek and you don't have a bridge you're probably going to want to nix nay on this because it's going to leave marks in your cheeks that's what they look like really really chic they're seen all in black with like a, a platinum palladium kind of color here and uh, gunmetal excuse me gunmetal color very skiish very clean big bold in your face and they've got the horse bit here I like with Gucci engraved on the side here Gucci really cute really lightweight these are very lightweight these are really nice and white too um, I've had a hard time finding the white in these I did find one and I didn't want to pay a certain amount for it you know I'm staying within a budget if I can if when I do get my little extra spending money so these are really cute I do like these so if you ever get a chance to get these or maybe you see them on eBay or something like that really lightweight and you like big glasses these are pretty cool and boop, 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 boop. last but not least I got this one from uh, off of Saks this is their like uh, it's like a Norseman's rack but it's for Saks and it's called off uh, Saks Fifth Avenue this is what it came in and you know this 
is the big huge case you know the big huge box all the trimmings that came with it these are called the babushka sunglasses they're babushka they had a collection the handbag is just fierce this gorgeous handbag the babushka they don't have the name babushka in them but uh the handbags are called babushka and then the shoes had this studding on it i think rihanna had the shoes or if not the handbag but these are like a see-through brown i wore these all probably through spring i wore these a lot and they're aviator type styles covers my eyebrows they have a gradient to them they're pretty lightweight considering the studs they've got this beautiful studding detail here i love it really cute really nice one of my favorites as far as Gucci as far as something a little bit more flashy this is really really cute really 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 cute love them so that's all for my Gucci if you have any questions or comments uh, please leave them I'll be more than happy to answer them for you I built this collection over a period of years I'm talking about a period of seven years so I did not get all this at once. I saved my pennies. I waited for sales. You know, uh, I waited for like, there's uh, Nordstrom anniversary sales have great deals and uh, the women's and the, the women's half yearly sale. I wait for that too for Nordstrom's. They have good deals and office sacks. That's normally where I get my sunglasses sometimes I do go on eBay but you have to really know your pieces in order to really feel confident when buying off of eBay um, unless they've got the receipt and the tag and the box and everything and it's the actual picture and it's not a factory shop picture uh, I would wouldn't recommend it but that's another video so if you want a video on how to shop on eBay and look for authentic sunglasses or authentic bags maybe something more specific like authentic Marc Jacob bags or authentic Gucci bags or authentic Chanel's um, maybe I'll do one on that but anyway rate comment subscribe and I'll see y'all later peace out